Alright, hey guys, um, well, I'm actually pretty excited to see these pictures, because, um, Comic-Con 2010, I believe, yeah, 2010 is, um, when they show, kind of showed, um, some clips for the um, Ultimate Spider-Man, um, series that'll be coming out, um, I believe early, early, um, 2012. Yo, know, Disney XD coming to Disney XD 2012. Um, this is actually looking very, very nice. It's I'm suppose I'm guessing it's gonna be based on the Ultimate Comics, so um, that's going to be awesome. Now, first of all, Peter's suit it looks amazing. It looks how a Spider-Man should. Uh, oh. How a Spider-Man su suit should look. Now, the one thing I always say, if you are going to draw a Spider-Man or you're going to, um, what, are you, are you going to make him into a movie? You always have to have those kind of those little peaks out of the corner of the eyes. And he has that in this picture. And I, I simply love it. I love it. And that that's what you should always have in a on a Spider-Man map, and I just, it just makes me smile to see these pictures, um, um, uh, Peter's apparently six feet exactly, um, and we see one without color, um, and we see a side profile, we see a profile picture, and, um, a back view and a front view picture, we see his, uh, his arms kind of cut off, you can see his arm separately and his hand and I think that's um that's nice um this is very very good I, I love this picture quite a bit what and I say that because I saw the the footage from the um ultimate spider-man um some leaked footage from comic-con I saw that footage that footage looks very good Apparently he's working with Nick Fury or working with or for. Um, he's um successful with MJ. Um, I think she might be working at the Daily Bugle. I mean the yeah. Jonah, like in the comics, he's the mayor. I I think of New York. He yeah he's the mayor of New York I believe, and so he's pretty much banning out banning Spider Man. And I'm sure that's gonna be a great dynamic because pretty much the cops. And the cops around that that city and that state are pretty much going to be on Spider-Man's tail, while secretly contradicting that he's working for Shield, the government agency. So that's going to be um quite good, cause I'm assuming maybe at some point um um Spider-Man gets into a, a lot of trouble and he's cornered by a whole lot of cops. And then maybe Nick Fury or a, bu a couple of S.H.I.E.L.D. agents, they walk in, they show him their badge, they talk to J. Jonah Jameson, and um, pretty much snap, boom, bam, boom, they um, they tell Jameson he, what he will not be doing, pretty much. I mean, pretty much they don't have to listen, they don't, I'm assuming that they don't answer to Jameson, and that they only answer to, like, the president, and um, different um, world leaders. So, uh, he's not really a world leader, I mean, he's more of just, like, um, a certain s leader of that particular section of the world, so he's not gonna really, I'm sure he's he's gonna bark at him and tell him, this is Spider-Man, I've been chasing him for a long time, chasing him for many years now, he's been a thorn in my side for I don't know how long, and they're gonna tell him, well, he's working with us, pal, so, um, you either have to comply, or you get, you have to step down, and so, um, uh, uh, t you tell me what what the obvious choice would be. I'm I'm sorry. I just can't stop looking at the eyes. The eyes are amazing. Oh man, just how the eyes. The mask is perfect. The mask is perfect. That's exactly how it should be. Um, we also see it in color. I like the. It's kind of like maybe a darker darker blue uh, I do like that it's a very dark it's kind of a it's not a dark a very dark dark blue but it's a 
darkish blue, and I th it works well with uh with the suit. And the colors, the red and the black for like the symbol, pretty much the same. And that's that's all right. That's what should. That's how I like it. And I'm hoping maybe he'll be doing the black suit. And well, he probably will be doing the black suit because he did it in the last two series. And so um, can looking forward to how that's gonna look. Um, we see Venom. Now Venom, he's looking. Like he like he's looking pretty ultimate. He I um he looked how he kind of looks in the in the game, the yeah in that game and I and I love that game and so I love the design of him and he looks kind he looks pretty menacing. Looks he I like I like his teeth how his teeth look kind of like dog teeth kind of sharpened and there's that that one in the middle and so that's that looks fantastic and then he had like two. Sharp teeth beside that middle one up top. Oh wow! I mean, yeah, it looks like one, probably two, yeah, probably two. But um, he looks kind of buff up top, kind of skinny and like towards the torso area, and that is just fantastic. I love this. Sh this show is going to be amazing. This show is going to have a lot of stuff going for it. I'm hoping it'll last longer than um the spectacular Spider-Man. Because the Spectacular Spider-Man was a great show, but it was just canceled, I guess, for, I don't know why, maybe to reboot the series, or reboot a, Sp a Spider-Man series, I don't know, but, um, looking pretty good. We have one of Peter, now, um, this, I'm assuming this is just concept art, because this pretty much is just concept art, but, um, Peter's face looks pretty good pretty good i don't have any, i don't really have any complaints i like the way his hair looks looks like he kind of has he i don't know what you call it but he kind of like side bangs i don't know if that's what it's called but it's kind of like side bangs or whatever i'm hoping for maybe a a different look maybe the nose can be angled a little bit differently but pretty much is how this is how it's going to look I'm hoping a little bit. I'm hoping a little bit more drawn in. Obviously, um, looking pretty awesome, pretty awesome. And um, and MJ during the series, I'm assuming she's gonna be um, kind of like at every fight where Peter is or try or tries to be, and she looks like she has a camera of some sort, and um. Like video um, recording what's happening and like going off to the side, doing like that photography thing for Peter uh, occasionally and like going around the situation, like looking at key details what Peter can't see while he's fighting or while he's in a situation or stuff of some sorts. So um, looking forward to this show quite a bit. Um, I want to see the fighting techniques. Um, looking pretty darn good. I want to see how the Green Goblin is going to look. I wonder if it's going to be, I'm hoping, I wonder if it's going to be the ultimate Green Goblin. I don't have too much problems with that. Um, pretty, a monster, pretty much, like Hulk's, Hulk, a Hulk-like monster. Flying look. But, um, I want to see what the Green Goblin looks like. Doc, Doc Ock. Black pe black uh, cat and um a whole lot more characters. So let me know what you guys think. Comment down below. Are you excited for this? Uh, as as much as I am, cause I'm pretty happy right now. Um, don't forget we have a fight coming up. We have some fights coming up. I'm gonna be doing a couple fights. So let me know what you guys want to see. And I'll do my very best to pick the best of them. And, um, I'll do them. Um, we also have a war in the YouTube community. Um, look at my previous video. It says Coolio Vids 101 Rerise Now. And it'll explain everything. Alright guys, um, don't forget to comment, subscribe, like the video. And, um... I'll see you next time. Excelsior.